The 70th anniversary season of the Blue Angels comes to a close this weekend. The first of two homecoming shows held this afternoon on board NAS Pensacola. News 5's Debbie Williams and photojournalist Randy Lowe have the sights and sounds. The Blue Angels take into the air this afternoon. Not only is it special because this is their homecoming weekend, it's also Veterans Day. The Blue Angels streaked across the sky for almost an hour in a near flawless performance, proving it's good to be home. More than 100,000 fans straining to see every twist, turn, and near miss. The roar of the FA-18 Hornets reverberating through the crowd. I love this sound. I love this sound in your chest whenever they go by. It's awesome. It just makes you, um, it's a thrill-seeking kind of feeling. For veterans, this was a special show. Well, I'm a veteran. I'm ex-Navy. And uh, so this is part of my, my heritage here. For the smallest fans. The loop -de -loop. Well, it was pretty good too. That's cool, cool. cool. Yeah. At the end of the show, the final maneuver, the missing man formation, in honor of Captain Jeff Coos, killed in a crash over the summer. The season now nearly over, the Blues have triumphed over that tragedy and are back home. <laughs> the Blue Angels take to the air for their last show of the 70th anniversary season, Saturday afternoon at 2 o'clock. On board NAS Pensacola, Debbie.